just a quick video guys gals uh, I finally got my shovel 36 inch my very first 36 inch push shovel made by Grant it's a Canadian company uh, a very good company I got it online uh, from website Granger.com uh, good website I didn't have any problem with the shipping the price is reasonably fair I got this for close to 90 bucks doesn't include the shipping and handling and um, I think now they they're they price more now now that winter is getting closer um, 36 inch I never had a 36 inch before and I always wanted one I always I always wanted to have that uh, the snowplow the snowplow.com push shovel from the US it's the uh, the very popular one I think it's still popular these days in the US very tough shovel never owned one uh, but from what I can tell because I watch I watch a bunch of videos of that uh, this is almost identical they have the uh, the blade is is that one of the toughest blade I don't know the term UHMV UH it's it's poly I don't think they're the same type but I call it poly maybe even better than poly poly polyethylene the four abbreviation UHMV or UHUV uh, one of the toughest plastic out there in the market today and this is the one uh, you can actually uh, you can use this as chopper if you want to chop some ice or scrape some ice no problem this this shovel can handle that and it's just very tough very tough the handle you guys know that I love the V handle um, we have the Home Depot here and the Lowe's sell this 36 inch but I didn't buy it because because of the handle they have this ergonomic handle which you can grab it with two hands and then push I'm not a fan of that to some it works for them but for me I don't like it um, I've tried that before yes I've tried it before and uh, it doesn't doesn't work for me it's too heavy and too weird to use um, this one here you get all the power when you push it and even when you try to scoop snow you know this is it you should dominant hand and uh, um, you know I'm a, I'm a lot more efficient when using a, a D handle now one of the things I like about this too is the uh, the handle it's 55 inch one of the longest handle out there in the market some of them the the handles are 40 plus inches which is um, still great but for me this is this is good because so I can push the snow further and faster than this uh, tough too I don't know what this is made of I should have done my research right <laughs> maybe fiberglass but they're tough uh, I I know they're tough because I've used this for last season and um, I, I I've used this in all types of condition all types of snow all types of driveways and this is always uh, this is always 
it, it always saves me and and I'm hoping and I'm sure that this will be uh, the same type of quality as this one it's a commercial grade made for for contractors and uh, if a homeowner will use this they will um, it's, it's gonna last them a lifetime for a regular home home use um, I'm sure there are more Oh, when, it, when this one arrived, I checked the bolts. I checked for cracks. Um, they seem to be okay. Uh, they're okay. Just the bolts. A couple of bolts are loose here. And some are one of these bolts. The blade is not straight. Uh, it's a little bit warped. But I think that's from, I don't know, from storage. Or shipping and uh, if you look closely it was actually worse than before than when it arrived but now I had that standing for a long time for two to three weeks in uh, in the cold here in the cold and heated garage of ours and uh, I think it's it's starting to straighten out A good shovel can't wait to use it and uh, I'm probably gonna I'm probably going to use this this week we have storm coming and the, the storm is not the storm that I like it's uh, snow will be very wet rain and then just like the last time rain and then snow we have above freezing temperature so they will start melting then followed by freezing temperature minus 7 minus 10 degrees celsius uh, but it will be okay i have my snow master with me and uh, in case i it gets really heavy then i could use that um, great 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 machine. And this one here is, I forgot to talk about this. This is the, uh, the brand is Snow X. It's a 30, 36 inch wide snow pusher with wheels. Uh, it's like those uh, the Kona blade or Snowcaster that those brands do I, I, I could order them I can buy them but they're insanely expensive again we're looking at four to six hundred bucks depends on on the season too right but all coming from the US that's their price insane price that doesn't include the tax and the shipping so we're looking about <laughs> almost the price of a new snowblower uh, i will make another video of this i haven't opened the box yet you can see but it's it has weight 12, 12 pounds 12 pounds so i'll make another video of this the assembly should be a breeze and uh i can only do one video right now uh it's 36 inch these are the things that i use to do snow removal and uh, whenever I buy things, I do a lot of research. I uh, do a lot of research. I want to make sure the best 
that I can search that it will it will help me and uh, when I purchased this it helped me greatly and I know that this snow X uh, the push shovel with wheels will greatly help me too and uh, I just need to get used to it which is should take me uh, should take it should only take me minutes before I get used to it this I won't be using all the time uh, maybe when you have two three inches of snow maybe a little heavy that's fine but the lighter the better and uh, we'll see how I how I do um, windrow with this uh, and I have other favorite shovel too but it all depends on the type of snow and conditions right um, some snow you really need to scoop it really scoop it not with this but you know uh, it's too heavy you can't push it you gotta scoop it I can always use my sh my snow blower but I know some of you don't have snow blowers and you only have shovels and uh, I'd like to show you how I how I how I do it my way maybe uh, you can learn from that or you know maybe not <laughs> that's all I have for now and uh, I've been wanting to make a video but I said to myself I'm going to do some research and uh, you know got all the lists all the features but I just can't do that just too many things going on and um, I think I said all I said all so